going on here? Can I just go down? Might be able to go down. Yikes. Oh. What in the world? Okay. Still going on, I guess. <gasps> Snow! What is going on here? What the? Some of that weird snow is way up in the trees. Need a good strong wind. <laughs> Just need to control the wind is all simple. Yeah, right. How do I do that then? Hold on. Yeah, it ain't that easy. Wait a second. Wait a second. Control the wind with this. Oh, yeah. Who huh. down you go? Oh, boy. Ugh. I am not going to die here tonight. I'm just not. I need to see what's in this hollow. I need to get into that house. Okay, let's go. Getting into the house again? Maybe not now. Okay. So, we're gonna go with something here. Once again. Alright. Need something special for this. Oh god, I have to get back into that house. This is the worst, longest night ever. Yikes. I already forgot the initial uh, voice for Adina Astra. It's just way gone over my head now because it's like... 3 freaking AM now, freak me. <laughs> okay. Can I just enter? Oh no. Um. Okay, what about hitting that? No, no, no. Nah, it ain't that easy. Okay, hold on. Okay, how about hitting it from here? Nah. Too high. Nope. Here she comes. Stay off my porch. I'm so cold, so cold. No, I'm an astronomer. Those are my skies, damn it. I'm gonna survive this. Wait, so what should, what should I do here? Hold on. I just have nothing much with the uh, stuff. Oh, wait. Do I just like go down or why? Oh, okay. Let me do this multiple times then. Need to get into the house. Eh? Okay. It's somewhere to hide. Set 
Mister, your friends in the Brambles night. She seems distracted by that weather thing. Maybe. Hmm. Weather thing. To the brambles. Oh boy. Squirrels. Now we're going black. Going warm the dark. Oh boy. Ah, uh, this weather never behaves. Because I do all damn thing every time. Ooh. Okay, let's go. Blue Fire I discovered your secret name. A bird team in the earth and a bullet build house. Oh boy. Oh, and who are you? I can get you out of here. You can't even get yourself out of here. You can barely get out of the attic. Get away from that extremely creepy shrine. It's not safe for you here. Did you know I met that poison and she never even thanked me? She'll take all the credit for it. What? I know, right? Get away! Oh shit. I see. Just gonna keep doing this all the time. I love this game. Alright. Let's redo this. Ready. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. We haven't finished our talk, man. Get away if you can. Okay. There it is. Now, blow us! Oh boy. Okay, that's done. Get out, get out, get out. <laughs> oh my god, that was close. I think if I had not gotten that, I think I would have to repeat all the thing way back when I died. So. What does this do? And no music too for the fun times and what stuff. Nope. Just bit of snowman. Make sure with the branches. I wish I could make a happy face, but probably with the bone? Nah, I don't know. Uh yeah, like that. Expensive face, sorry. <laughs> and a uh, good old one hat or something, probably. Or maybe just that, actually. And you. The magical thing there. Ooh. Right clicking it even does something. Well, no way back now. No! <coughs> no! Oh my god. That is indeed Spark Soul. <gasps> oh boy. What is this? Oh. Oh god. No. Girl, what have you done? You. 
You watched it happen. You watched. It wasn't me. It was this place. It was the oven. It was what you became. I didn't get to choose what happened to me. I was so cold. I was so afraid. I had to survive. And I did not. What is this? Who are you? Don't you dare speak, you waste of a girl. I was her twin. We fled into the woods, identical in all things, except one. When she pulled my body from the water, the only part of me she kept was the tattoo. I've kept it close to me all down the centuries. I believe in some idea of you that is as long dead as I am now. But you survived. I... I... Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I, I'm so sorry for this. Get out. I'm sorry. I never meant to... Get out! Hmm. Yes, me. What is this story about? What do you want it to be about? If I get to choose what it's about, it's not about anything. Huh, that's quite a statement. I'm really smart. Well, you came up with that plan to rob banks. So clearly you're onto something. I want to know what this is about. I think you have to figure that on your own. I don't like that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I guess that's the end. Yeah. Well, more or less so. More or less so. Oh my god. Hello again. Ah, we meet again. I hope you are faring well. We were just leaving. Why? Because the kingdom needs a king, and this king needs his trusted advisor. What happened to your sword guy? Stevenson! He had a name, you know? Uh, sorry, what happened to him? Did you see the forest god? Stevenson! We're going home now, I command it, and I'm king. Yes, home now. I'm going to call a late night feast. It'll be a new tradition, sir! This will be the best, longest night ever! Too true! Well, happy longest night! The best longest night! Yes, that! Be safe! Let's sing a longest night carol! Yes, that will raise our spirit! La 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 la! <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's fun. And what about this? I forgot where I started. Is it from here? Yeah, not much. <laughs> yep. I think they just sang to the longest night. The Lost Constellation. So is Athena Astra doing fine then? Okay, let's revisit the forest god. Oh, hello. How are you doing? You're a fraud! Why, hello! Nice to meet you, stop by. 
There are fruit dead people all over this woods. I've talked to half of a dozen of them tonight alone. I don't know what takes you up on this coffin business or you never fall through. So which is it? Huh? You talk to girls? Yeah, a whole bunch. I think you got lost and cold and started talking to the snow. No, I've been all the way from the forest god's mountain to the hunter's hollow for God's sake. And yet here you are, back at my cabin. Not more than an hour after you last left. Letting the heat out and the cold in. Easy night for you, eh? Oh, God to hell. <laughs> hell swarms at least. Good night. <laughs> That's the end. That's the end. Just lock. Immediately like that. Oh my god, and then there's you. Hey! Hey, you! Still alive, eh? I just saw all the trees give a great shudder. Like they were falling into line. And then you walked up. I think the way is open to the frozen lake. What do you think about that? I think you should wrap up any business you have and head east as quickly as possible. Hmm, what business will I still have? I wouldn't pretend to know. I'm a bit nervous about the frozen lake. Do you know the story? Not really. Of how the lake was so deep, it went down to the grave and the dead came to the surface and spoke with the lying, living, sorry, of how it was so black that it ate the moon's reflection and how the moon being jealous convinced the sun to turn its back on the lake so it will be forever frozen that is why the dead may be found beneath the ice for they can no longer leave those waters did any of that happen? you're the one going there you tell me nice line hey there, uh, you okay? I didn't have a chance to ask about you and how you got here. I think I'm gone. I can hardly hear you. <gasps> oh. Yes. Uh, thank you so much. You saved my life, fortune teller. I was a real one, you know. It was real to me. Even if my sister in the walls. Hello? <gasps> Goodbye. Oh man. The souls are going to where they should go. This is getting heartbreaking. Getting really heartbreaking. And then this full one that I made too. Are you going already, Sticky? Sorry, Sticky. Hmm, not much saying. Yep. They're going where they should go. Frozen leg, here we come. And then there's this one too. In their wings, in their trees. All things die, be at peace. Cease all care, they are coming. God of the forest, carry us. Still can go? Oh yeah. Oh, you're already gone, huh? I hope you're going someplace better. Thanks. Wow, yeah, this is getting really heartbreaking. That hong is still going. Maybe due to the wind. Oh, then there's you too. Oh, that doesn't affect her anymore, eh? This is the worst, longest night ever. 
Here's the better days. Oh, and that's the end. Yeah. I'm sorry, your god is gone. But that does somehow like transport you to the other realm of world or something. Wait, what? Another one? Huh. Must be procedurally generated. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Should be too long. Probably. Nope. That's not the same visitors anymore. Open? Oh wait. Okay, never mind. Oh yeah, it is. Look at this transition. Arr. Can I just throw that cat? I really wish that I can throw the cat. My aim sucks. Yep. Welcome to the frozen lake. They said. Hey cat, figured I see you here. You figured right. You figured wrong. How's that? I didn't die in there. So you didn't. But then again, I've never died in there either. So pardon me if I'm not overly impressed you did it once. You are such an ass. You certainly caused a lot of trouble tonight. I didn't mean to, just passing through. Isn't that always the way? I have to go now... So, who are you, really? Pardon? You some magical cat? Cat god? Cat wizard? Something? I'm just a cat. I live near the woods. I like shiny things. And I listen. Oh. Your turn. Who are you? Ah, I'm an astronomer, I'm a survivor, wow. That impacts deeply. I'm an astronomer. I'm here because there's something missing in the sky. And this is where I'll find it. Are you sure? At this point, I'm so exhausted and cold that I can't afford to not be sure. That's either very silent or very beautiful. It's very true. I'm freezing. I have to get going. The hunter, her child, the forest god, those aren't your business. I know. Leave all that here. You are in their forest. I'm an astronomer. It may be their forest, but it's under my sky. <laughs> I bet that sounded great in your head. It sounded great when I said it, ass cat. Goodbye, Athena the astronomer. Good luck. Goodbye, cat. Happy longest night. <laughs> wow. Wow, sound echoes. Whoa. You know, I don't do make it. A promise is a promise. How is home? 
same as ever. Color now, of course. The sheep shut down the Five Street Bridge again on Long's Night Eve. <laughs> the farmers were there all day trying to pull them off. I had to figure it out why they keep doing that. No one has a clue. Hmm. I know you can't stay long. I can, so ask. Okay, did you find the ghost star? I did. My first night dead. It's there. Wow. Oh my god. Something like that. Do you remember where that is? Yes. It's funny. What is? It's always been there. I just had no way of seeing it. You still can. Not really. But you can chart where it is. That's something at least. Wow. I feel like just a few feet away. There's this thing bigger than I can think about. Burning away. Exploding. And between us is this sheet of black. And when I think about it, I feel like I'm going to overflow. I think about this a lot these days. We devote ourselves to something we barely understand. Something we can never touch. We give it a name, and we give ourselves a name for doing so. All of it creates this connection. And that connection, that becomes the thing we can touch. You appreciate those connections even more after we've died. I'm gonna miss you all over again now. Well, on the bright side, you gotta start out of it. That's something at least. <laughs> Pretty amazing to be something at least. Yeah. Goodbye, astronomer. Goodbye, astronomer. Oh. Yen. What constel what constellation was it? No one knows. It's lost to history. Did this really happen? Does it matter if it really happened? I think it does. Well, we'll never know. But hearing it happen to you... And that's something. Something, something, something. I want to find that constellation. Go outside some night and find it. And tell me where it is, okay? <sighs> You look tucked out, kid. I am. I leave you to it. Sweet dreams, kiddo. That's nice. Nice one little story indeed. Wow. A Negative Wood Supplemental. <laughs> What happened to the my mouse? Oh my god. Again by Halak Loka, Scott Benson, and Bethany Hockerberry. And that fox too. It's a she. Thanks to our textures. Nice. That really looks like Maya. Are you serious? Special thanks to Element Baker Saltzman. And with Kickstarter backers. Kickstarters for Pete's sake. And you. Oh. Those are the snowmen that I created. Damn. That is awesome. Athena Astra. 
Knock in the woods. Nice. Wow, that was something indeed. I do notice that I'm not too consistent with my voice, character voicing for the rest of them because it appears that I really overdid myself there. Probably this happens to be something that you have to complete in a go or else like that it doesn't save. I do not know. Definitely looking forward to Nagano Woods though. Um, thanks for watching folks. Looking forward definitely to Night in the Woods. Uh, I'll see if I can like separate this into a um, couple parts probably to make it like bearable for the watchers or something. But boy, and this a thing. Have the nice longest night. Pretend it has the music. <laughs> Nothing there. <laughs>